Westport Middle has been doing some exciting work with science, technology, engineering, and math, or STEM learning. Recently, students engaged in a special space engineering boot camp, thanks to the folks at the University of Louisville's Roush Planetarium. For our first game, our first activity, we're going to put you in two different groups. We are at Westport Middle School and we are in an after school program. You're going to come up with as many space related words as possible. We're spelling galaxy. All of y'all do have it, okay? This is the space and engineering boot camp. We learn about space, we do all kinds of fun projects. We're basically exploring space and the facets that go along with it. We built a soda car. Uh, we started making prototype rockets, and we um, do, started doing this. Today, we have went ahead and built a self-sustaining uh, ecosystem in outer space. They've been basically designing their own city on Mars. If something were to happen on Earth, we are designing like a backup place we could go to. We need to make how to find an area how to survive on Mars because there's not really much things that things that's different in Mars. They have less material than we have in Earth. So, yes, so we have to figure out how we're going to survive. Food, um, fuel, a toilet, um, hair products and makeup, I guess. I thought that it would be fun and maybe it'll help me learn more about science and all that. They will build like the build the ice cream. They were probably not necessarily all aware of the atmospheric conditions or, you know, uh, of Mars. And so they were exploring with combining and making their own um, ecosystem or self-sufficient system. What is it made of? And then having to take that and then they can make their own spin and make it their own design. They could do it in any fashion they want so they can be creative and apply those science concepts to see what they could come up with. Once they start getting a, like a holding cell set up, then we'll launch the food and supply ship. In this enclosed system, it's a lot like your spaceships that you created. You have to make sure you have food, energy, ways to get rid of waste, ways to get energy in. This is going to be the same way. It's going to be your own enclosed ecosystem. We're a partnership school with U of L. Um, here at Westport. Because of us being a partnership school over the last few years, many of our teachers have went ahead and, and used funds for uh, retaining national boards, they have classes here, and so that, because that's partnership grown and, and over the years, it's just we continue now doing things like this for our school and students. All of us here have probably had a dream of going to space. It's a pretty amazing subject to study and learn about, so we're here to learn how to become astronauts or how to learn space and become people who work with NASA or something like that. It basically tells us about like anything that's in science but expands the knowledge of science. More advanced than just a regular science course. I'm uh, sure some kids may like sports but they would like the science behind that sport or they would like the the intrigue or the storyline behind whatever it may be. It's just their interest and that's, that's what's keyed in. That's what's exciting. So to see them explore their interest.